Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Kembali lagi dengan saya guys Oke di kesempatan kali ini saya kembali reaksi Sesuai dengan judul yang di bawah Oke tapi sebelum kita lanjut dengan video reaksi ini Kita intro dulu Boom Yo On my grind all day Gonna make a million sun ass someday You know I'm in the bedroom when I ride this way Put me in the pound when I bite this game uh, Bitch I'm an animal Eating these rappers I swear I'm a cannibal About to fulfill all my dreams I'm a fiend I've been plotting and scheming This shit is obscene Oke okay guys, di kesempatan kali ini saya akan mereaksi uh, senjata baru rakyat Palestina yang menyerang Israel. Oke, okay, itu senjata itu uh, dibuatlah layang-layang yang di bawahnya itu ada bola api yang digantung oleh layang-layang tersebut. Oke, okay, kira-kira videonya seperti apa? Tetapi saya minta untuk kalian subscribe dulu channel ini dan share ke teman-teman kalian dan juga like ya kalau misalnya teman-teman suka oke okay, nggak usah banyak saya bacot lagi mari kita cek video alat senjata yang dibuat Palestina seperti apa langsung saja Assalamualaikum. So this is a Muslim response and thinking what I'm thinking about the fire on the most immoral land, Israel. And I was watching some YouTube videos. People were really, really exposing what they were there in their heart. They were saying, "Yes, very good. Is it not fire? They have their own lesson." No. Yes, I consider Zionism as an immoral, disgusting system in the world, and they have no morality and nothing in their heart. They have the heart is filled with the madness. That's why they're killing innocent children and women in Palestine, and what they did to Palestinian. And you know what? This fire is under. It's not in control. It's not in control. The half of the country is on the fire. More than 5,000 people have been displaced. Hundreds of the houses have been disposed to the fires, and they have lost their wealth and many have lost their life more than 41 people have lost their life according to fivefiller.com uk is a muslim website by the way it's a very good i would suggest you to whenever you have a want to have a news just go to this website the link is in description do you know very well what israel is doing to the palestinians killing them executing them capturing their children and women and doing every disgusting act like every tourist act but when israeli were in need and they were really suffering because of fire what palestinian did they offer their helps and they send their teams in the beginning the fellas israel authorities didn't accept their help but you know today they accepted that's what distinguish the muslims and the zionist the muslims are like a flower who give their frequencies to everyone even to the hand that crushes it's actually a saying of that ali bin talib may i please with him even though what israelis are doing to them for past four decades but yet they offer their own help and benjamin netanyahu he called them terrorists and he actually blamed them for the fire that they are the one who caused the fire but actually they are not the one because there is no evidence and it causes within the 
Jerusalem, a bit far from the east side of the Jerusalem, where the illegal Zionists are living and the Arabs are living. But the place where the fire being caused is not a place of Arab, it's a place of Zionist. And most importantly, Turkey sent their planes, the more advanced place, to help them and you know to shut down the fire and this again the Zionist the most terrorist and immoral person the Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu he appreciated their help even though he got help from the US and other countries but he appreciated the Turkish help because we literally want to help people when they need a help we don't care who they are but we help them just because they are human because the Quran says in Surah Maida chapter 32 that if you save any life whether it be a non-Muslim or non-Muslim anyone it says, do you save the whole humanity? That's what we believe. We don't want anything bad for them, but we also don't want anything good for the Zionist because we need to be responsive as well. But we want safety for the people who are peaceful and who have nothing to do with the Zionist movement. And we also thank the Palestinian Authority for helping them and also want to appreciate. I'm really proud of the Turkish government who sent their helps to help them out. But importantly, there were online enough debates, people are debating that it's good the fire is there, so at least they have their lesson. And I would like to know what you think about the fire in the Israel and what Palestinian did and Turkish did. I want to have your opinion in the comment section and let's share things together. Asalaamu Alaikum. Wa Alaikum Asalaam. Oke okay, guys, itulah video reaction dari dari saya. Uh, kali ini pendapat saya terhadap senjata yang dibuat Palestina atas apa protes karena penjajahan Israel bahkan dibantai-bantai Palestina. Itu saya pikir kebakaran yang merugikan Israel itu memang sangat besar tetapi tidak sebanding dengan apa yang kemudian dirasakan oleh Palestina terhadap bantaian Israel terhadap Palestina itu untuk itu saya pikir kolom komentar teman-teman tulis teman-teman di kolom komentar pendapat teman-teman terhadap senjata yang dibuat Palestina terhadap Israel ini eh, bagaimana gitu karena menurut saya itu yang apa namanya saya pikir itu sebuah apa namanya bentuk yang dimana sebuah protes Israel itu eh, Palestina itu kepada Israel itu yang dibuat layang-layang dari bahan apa bekas sangat kreatif juga saya pikir begitu ya eh saya tidak usah banyak bacot lagi saya cuma melihat komentar teman-teman di yang teman-teman tulis di kolom komentar supaya saya bisa tahu teman-teman punya pendapat terhadap ini itu seperti apa ya sampai ketemu lagi dengan video saya selanjutnya salam manisih